thank you. Uh, since I last saw you, your film is kind of exploding, and this yeah. weekend's gone transatlantic very yeah, successfully. It's really weird. <laughs> <laughs> Has, how's the whole kind of whirlwind of this experience been for you? I mean, like, we couldn't have called it. If we look back to, like, even when we last spoke to you, like, just, it was exciting, cool, we're putting our baby out to the world, but somehow it's just, like, people have been, like, we want a bit of this. And it's just such an honour to be a part of. This film has resonated with so many people. Has there been any people, audiences, when you've done Q&As and stuff, who've asked you a question, you've gone, actually, I didn't think of that before, or it's kind of changed your opinion of the of what the film you've made and stuff like that? Yeah, so much. Or, like, just people surmising the film as well in really interesting ways. There was a Q&A we did in Rome, and, it, well, it was, it was put down as a masterclass, right, with me and Molly. And they were basically giving us the masterclass. It was a group of, I think we were with like 20, kind of 16 to 18 year olds. Some of them had never even been to the cinema before. And they watched the film and they all just kind of debated it amongst them. And it was incredible to see that like, we were kind of giving young people this language to talk about like sex and consent in a way they probably never had done before. And also, I mean, we're so used to streaming these days and yeah. people have sought this film out in the cinema. Yeah. How exciting has that been for you guys that people have taken their time, spent their money to go to them rather than just watching it at home, which still would have a debate, but they can have a debate in such a bigger way. Yeah, it's amazing because also, like, I think it's a really exciting time that people are starting to fall in love with film again. So for them to take the time to choose our film to go and watch when there's incredible films out there right now as well, it's just like... Old people do actually want to see it. They're not just trying to be nice. <laughs> How excited have you been for Molly? Because she obviously put her blood, sweat and tears into this yeah. and now it's come to fruition in such an amazing way. Yeah, literally. Like There were a lot of moments on set that people have kind of asked me, like, you know, how did you get into this emotional state a lot of the time? And a lot of it was just thinking about how much this meant to Molly and what the work that Molly had put into it. So to now see this as the aftermath is just like... Yeah, it's amazing. Uh, as a final question, I've, I've been asking everybody this tonight, what's been your favourite film this year in the awards, in the awards mass? Which one's been your favourite? All of Us Strangers. So Molly is the only person to say something other than All of Us Strangers. Really? Yeah. What did she say? All things. Okay, see, I haven't seen that yet. Um, it seems to be the prevailing opinion that All of Us Strangers yeah. is pretty good. Yeah, <laughs> just, just a bit. It's just kind of all right. Yeah. <laughs> Tell us what it was like to, I know you spoke about the inspiration in that room. Yeah. What the, Did you have any conversations with anyone in there? That you, did you get to speak uh, to anybody? A little bit with um, Paul Mascal and Andrew Scott. And they're just like, I'm trying to play it cool because they're just so cool. And I'm like, I'm just not cool enough. Um, yeah, it's just, just amazing to hear what people have to say about filmmaking. Because it's like still just baffled to kind of be in this world so yeah just even more inspiring what uh, what has this whole experience given you going forward in your career what do you think the whole thing has kind of given you confidence and, yeah, and a little bit yeah. of maturity if you like yeah definitely like the confidence and also just the realization of what film can do for people and um the conversations that it can get started and you know there's a lot that obviously needs changing in the world and if we can kind of be a tiny tiny part of that it's just incredible Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys! Hey you guys! <laughs> hey you guys! <laughs> hey, that's what they all say. Hey you guys! Hey you guys!